The next question is from Aman Kumar. Aman Kumar is a revert from Bihar, India. He's asking a question. I am from a Hindu family. I have converted to Islam one and a half year ago after watching your video and of Maulana Tariq Jamil Ji, which was explained by a Muslim friend of mine. But my family does not know this and they are skeptical. I tried to convince my family that the idol they worship is wrong, but they don't believe it. If I explain, then they say that is the whole world, in brackets Hindus, are they wrong? And are you the only one who's right? I also told them that it is okay, you do not listen to me, you read the Hindu religious book. It is written in it, but they do not even read it. And in the house of a Hindu who worships Murti idols, I feel that I have not done any shirk and that I have to go through a lot of hardships. So I want you to tell me what to do. Lastly, I would like to thank you for helping me recognize the truth and accepting Islam. I would like to thank you too, Brother Aman Kumar, for coming to the straight path and accepting Islam. May Allah reward you and may Allah bless you and may Allah grant you Jannah. As far as the question is concerned that when you tell to your family members and to your parents not to do idol worship, they say that are all the other people in the world wrong? Are the Hindus wrong? You should tell them that whatever majority people do is not always correct. Many centuries ago, most of the human beings believed that the world was flat. That does not mean that they are right. Today we know that the world is spherical. So majority is not always correct. People in the past thought that the light of the moon was its own light. Today we know after science has advanced that the light of the moon is not its own light. It is a reflected light of the sun. So just because majority people have a belief, that does not mean that the majority are always right. And if that is the argument that your family members are giving, that majority are Hindu, that's the reason, and they do idol worship, therefore you have to do idol worship, you have to tell your family members that in the world, the people that practice maximum any religion, number one is Islam. In senses, theoretically, maybe Christians are more. But the people who practice any religion, number one are Muslims. The number one religion which is practiced maximum in the world is Islam. There are more than 2 billion Muslims in the world. More than 26% of the world population are Muslims. Compared to Hindus, we are much more. Hindus are about 1.2 billion. So if you're going on majority, there are more Muslims in the world than Hindus. So does it mean if that is what you believe that more people are correct, then you should be a Muslim? As you ask the question that you're living in a Hindu family and they are not aware that you have accepted Islam one and a half year back, what should you do? Even though you're abstaining yourself from shirk, my advice to you would be that slowly and with hikmah, explain to your family about the haq, about the truth and reveal to them that you have accepted Islam. Initially, they may be angry, they may be sad that you have accepted Islam, but that is the best because once you explain to them and reveal to them that you have accepted Islam, inshallah, inshallah, they will agree with what you have done. It will be easier for you to practice your deen. It will be also easier for you to convince them about Islam. And it will be easier for you to prove to them that what they are doing, idol worship, is wrong. It's a shirk. You can very well quote the scriptures. You can give them my cassette on similarities between Islam and Hinduism, where I've proved from their scriptures that idol worship is wrong. And inshallah, it will be easier for you to practice your deen and even get them to the straight path. So my request to you is reveal to them the favorite Islam with hikmah and continue your dawah with them. Inshallah, that will be the best for you.